people are looking at me like I'm nuts. Hey, super fans. It's time for another location scout, and this time we're in Southern California. It's downtown Orange, the historic district, and it's a place that's lost in time. With all the development in Southern California, this place is just untouched, and it's so amazing to see. And it's also a very popular place, which is why I wanted to make sure that I got here early. So what we are doing is we're gonna check out That Thing You Do. And this is a movie that was written and directed by Tom Hanks. Check that car out. That is definitely 1964 or earlier. And that is where we're headed, it's 1964. But the first location we're gonna check out is Patterson's Appliances. This is where the headquarters or centerpiece of the movie was. Um, it's where Guy worked and he definitely did not want to be there. What's funny about this location is right now I'm coming up on Patterson's Appliances and you would have no idea that's where it's at. But this is it right there. That's Patterson's Appliances. Alright, so let's go across the street here real quick. And let's see if we can look into the windows here real quick and show you what the appliance store was. Now it's a toy store. Alright, let's see here. Be able to look in there. So probably a lot of glare. Now this main street right here in front of me. There's so much that happens on this main street. I mean, this this little section of street right here is where they did so much filming. So one of the fun things uh, to notice when you're at these locations and you, and you look at it is that in the opening shot of the film, they show this main street here. This is where Patterson's Appliances is. But right over here, there was a clock tower and a steeple, and those are not there. They don't exist. And so it's kind of fun to look at the movie shot and then look at the actual location and realize they must have done a map painting and painted those in, whether it was digital or actual map painting, I'm not sure. But it's kind of fun to see that. Thank you. Okay, run across the street. Here we go. All right. So this location, this is, uh, this is cool. Uh, I have never been here before and I'm so excited to find it. Um, I found this through Google Maps, believe it or not, because there's not a lot of details to go off of in the film. There's only one shot in the entire movie that shows this location and it's where Chad and TB Player were, were meter hopping and this is where Chad breaks his arm and so much happens because of that scene. If it wasn't for Chad breaking his arm, you wouldn't have Guy coming in as the drummer. Um, and changing the tempo and basically making the wonders the wonders. What I love about this is that I didn't have a lot to go off of, but I'm gonna show you what I looked at. I looked for this right here, that rectangular brick. It was a unique little piece that I felt like if I could find a building that had that, I would be able to find this location. And this is the location right here. Somewhere in here, probably in this gutter right here, is where Chad fell down and broke his arm. Now, this is pretty trippy. I had no idea this was right here, but right across the street is where Guy is eating at the cafe here under Watson's. Through those windows, there's a cafe. That's where he's eating. That's where the band's getting together, and that's where they come up with the name The Oneaters or The Wonders. Right through that glass, right in there. That's where they came up with The Wonders. And it's so cool because I had no idea this location was here while I was filming this location right here. All right, so now I'm gonna try to find my way to another spot. The spot is the Army Surplus store where TV Player was standing when he first heard that thing you do on the radio. This is it right here, the Army store. I was able to just notice this. This right here is in the movie and it's still there. Well, super fans, I hope you enjoyed this location scout for That Thing You Do. Love this movie so much, and it's so fun just to be walking around Erie, Pennsylvania, but yet it's Orange, California. Be sure to check out more episodes and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. Also, leave a comment below. We love hearing from you. We love hearing about locations that you've discovered yourself. You doing that thing you do. I don't know the rest of the words to this song, but it got played on the radio.